Morning. I haven't been here for quite a while, I don't think, with everything that I've been, that's been going on. I've made these videos for quite a long time. So today I'm going to be looking at Mini, in particular these rear screens, side windows I should say, how to get these fixed in uh, and sealed properly. Now at the minute this one has just got some like mastic type material pushed in the side. I want to get this screen out today and um, all cleaned out, all this chrome, all that chrome cleaned out. Then I'm going to use some inner tube rubber to fit round, reassemble all the window, clamp it and then I can trim it all neat and it should be watertight because at the minute this leaks down this gap here, leaks into the car. Um, I'm going to try this side first and then um, if that works successfully I'll do the other side. So I'll just pull this tighter over one side. Okay. I'll do. Okay. So let's get this windscreen out then. Um screwdriver. I need a screwdriver. First of all, push these Headrest down. As long as I can there. Yeah, that nah, fell off. So it's two at the back, two at the front. Let's get these ones off first. You know what, I don't think I can even get in the back anymore with these seats. What I might have to do is take these seats out. So I've got some new seats. I think I'm struggling at the minute is to Holding it. And how's that? Oh yeah, you can see on that there. Straight away. Which that's moving. Yeah, that's not very good at all. Right, let's get sorted and I'll be back. So, I have a little screw to undo here. Which is what I think I put in last time. <coughs> I'll screw it out. And this here. Should all... So, there we go. Oh god, dear me, this is all just horribly gunked up.
we go. That's out. Look at all that there. It's just gunk all over it. I'm going to have to scrape all that off. I think. Scraper is if it so I'm going to go around and scrape all of this off the glass first. next bit is to get the gunk off inside the trim which I seem to put on a long time ago I think it's going to be a lot of fiddling to get this out. So I'm not going to record it. So the next thing I'm doing now is to, I've got an inner tube. I'm going to cut cut it in half. Yeah, getting going now. Right, there we go. It's two lengths of rubber. Now, that's, I'll try and film the next one. I couldn't quite film this because it took a lot of fiddling around to get it in. I don't know if that's back bits in there right here either. Let's see, that's not in there right either. It needs to come off. round that's not on there right really really fiddly to get in A million miles off, it's just not in right. right. Nice, it's quite there as well. Trying to get this in there. That's it in. Right then. Just got it around there. When I came around all that, there's a little bit of a gap there. I'll cut the other side. Yeah, so okay. See that.
and side dent. This side. So that's back in now. Let's uh, See how it goes. Maybe I'll do the other side, but I'm not going to do it just today. Right, so that's a quick video. I don't know how much it showed about changing that or how successful it was. We'll have to wait and see on that. But um, it is doable, it's quite straightforward ish. Um, they didn't achieve for it. It's quite doable. Um, I'll wait and see. Not entirely convinced. Anyway, bye for now.